right? The big D says, I lost everything in the whole geographic region. Took the far sink out as well. How do I handle that? Took out both my far sinks. Because they have to be within synchronous replication distance. Well, you go back to no, no worse off than you were before. But can you prevent this? And the answer is yes, but you need some kind of hardened Farsync instance server. And I have been working very closely with a company in Israel called Exana, who actually develops and is working with me to put a Farsync instance on their box. Now, I'm not selling their solution, nor do I get anything from them, but they are working hard on this. So let me just do three or four slides on what they provide today. In 11G, they do have a solution that we have been working on together that allows them with their hardware, their hardened box, to be able to offload online logs, archive logs, and a control file, where are we here, so that they have enough information to be able to resuscitate the standby as a failed primary, kind of our old hybrid. And it does work. We are working on some of the idiosyncrasies there um, in, the, in the 11G timeframe because there is no far sync in 11G, right? So if you have that disaster, the recovery thing can pull that information from their box over and do a zero data loss failover, provided it had all the information. And there are some places that we have to work on to make sure that's really, sync, really um, tight. With the far sync environment, one, you have to have a far sync site somewhere else, because generally you don't want it in the same data center. With the Exana box, which we've been discussing with them, is the fact that it's a hardened box, it's got battery backup, it's got cellular network capability, Wi-Fi capability, and regular network capability. So they can put, they're going to put a far sync instance on there when you get to 12C, so that in the event that disaster strikes, they can hook into the cellular network if there's nothing around, and they can finish that failover in a zero data loss manner. And this is truly a perfect solution because now that box can be in the same site as your production database because you're not worried about geographic failure. So one of their, their keywords, and this is their slide, but I'll be honest with you, it does make sense to me. As far as the zero data loss, it's an alternative zero data loss solution for 11G. Obviously you have local standbys and things like that. But for 12C, it's an ideal zero data loss solution for Farsync because it's a lightweight instance that sits on their box perfectly. And like I said there's no additional license um, requirement for their box. So again, we are working with people and partners like Exana to be able to provide more hardened types of places to put your, zero, your Farsync instances. And they're at booth 45. Oh. <sighs>